Hi, this is a request for a video from from a student. Uh, I think he wants to be able to play this with a friend uh, who plays mandolin. And it's not the kind of tune I normally would play because it's super noty and that's not mostly the kind of banjo that I like to play. But uh, it's kind of Irishy. It's a tune called Red Haired Boy. But I'm happy to show him how I would play it if I did play it, which I don't really, but it's fine. Um, let me play it once through, um, uh, and then we'll break it down. So this is a red-haired boy. It's in the key of A. It's a G tuning, capoed up two frets. Let's see. So let's just break it down slowly, play this tune, Red Haired Boy. So we're going to start fourth string, third, st so fourth string, third, and then third again, but with then a hammer on at the second fret on the third string. Okay, continuing on up that scale because they're going to, so, so the next thing is this, I'll hit the open second string and hammer it on at the first fret. And then hit the open first string and hammer it on the second second fret. So what we have is hammer on, hammer on, hammer on. Okay. Now take your hand off of this and do a drop thumb with your right hand. So you're hitting the first string and then the second string with your thumb. is the second string at the first fret. Then, and that's the lead in note into the next line, uh, notes. So that's just a hammer on. Okay, so going on with the next line. So that's first string, third string, third string, hammered on the second fret, open second string, and then a, a drop thumb on the open third string. Hammer on, drop thumb. Okay, then, on right on that same third string, right where you were, it's easy to find, third, uh, second fret, third string. That's a pull off. And then fourth string, hammer on at the same fret, same second fret. Let's see, what, how why do I make this go smoothly when I'm playing it? Okay. What I do is hammer on, and then with my next finger, So you're hitting it with with at the third fret on the fourth string. So here's what we have so far. So and then we're just gonna ditty. <laughs> Finally a ditty. Bomb ditty. Um, or you can go and just leave out the ditty if you want. So, and then you play that part again. Hammer on, hammer on, hammer on, drop thumb, bum, hammer on. And that's where the similarity ends. Because to finish that that part, you're going to, after you after you went, you're going to go. So hammer on, open first string, ditty. 
So that's first string, fifth string with your thumb. Now, just put your middle finger down right next to, right next to your, where you have your, uh, your, your finger on the uh, first string at the fifth fret and do a drop thumb. And then you're going to do another drop thumb, but you got to get your finger down here fast. And then that's at the second fret, uh, first fret of the second string. Okay. And to finish that line off, that's second string open, third string, uh, second fret. Now, that's the whole first part, and you play it twice. But I want to point out that this is this is not like um, a lot of old time tune rhythm. It's very lilty and Irishy kind of. So it's kind of um, phrase. Okay, this is mostly on the first string. Um, so you're going to hammer on at the second fret. So hammer on second fret and then the third fret. And leave your finger down here. You're going to need it. Bomb diddy. Pull off. And that's a pull off where you're pulling off that string, but you're leaving your finger down. Second string, first fret. Hammer on, bum, diddy, pull off, hammer on, pull off, drop, thumb, bum. Okay, that's the first line. And then do that lead in business again. And then first string, third string, hammer on, and then take your finger off your fingers off and to do that drop thumb. Hammer on, drop thumb. That's on the second and third strings. Hammer on, that's a, that's the third string, the second fret. Drop thumb. So that little part so far, what we have there in the B is, um, okay, from the beginning of the B. just like in the first part in the first part pull off hammer on that's that's all at the second fret third string pull off hammer on fourth string also fourth string diddy this is like just so it ends up just the way the first part ends up so I'll show you which parts are the same and which parts are different. So from the very beginning of the A part. Bleed in, bum, bum, hammer on, drop, thumb, pull off, hammer on, bum, diddy, bum. So this is a repeat up to here. 
right to here. And then you play that part again. And then the B part. is different. This is starting to sound familiar, this part. And this line is just just, just like the first line. I mean the last line of the A part. Okay? Now I'm going to play the whole thing really slowly once or twice for you once you've kind of figured out the notes to be able to play along with it. Okay, building up speed on this tune can be a little tricky because you've got so many notes. Um, okay, and all of them are important in this tune. It's kind of hard to choose ones to leave out. We've left out some already. So here we go. Ready, and. Bye. 